Hello and welcome everyone to this session where we will talk about how to optimize your inspection interval for pressure relief devices using RBI 580. From a value perspective, right? The question is why? So API 580 or American Petroleum Institute's recommended practice 580 allows you to carry a risk-based inspection program for your pressure relief devices. Historically, owner operators do prefer a time-based approach just to make sure that they're not taking too much of a risk with that. But now we do see owner operators intending to optimize the inspection or testing frequency of their relief devices. The pressure relief device is one of the key drivers for typical turnarounds and the ability to extend the PRD testing interval based on a well-defined risk methodology can help enable extension of turnarounds. Application, any industries where you are having pressure relief devices, and that's one of the main component in any of your asset intensive industry. From a value perspective, obviously this helps you optimize your inspection cost, but it also helps you improve the overall reliability of your plant. Some of the key functions or values is, you know, it, this module helps you to better quantify risk associated with relief devices, provides you with an optimized inspection schedule, and also the methodology is closely aligned with that of the API RP 581. So on the right hand side, you can see this is just a snapshot of the methodology. It's pretty detailed and closely aligned with 581. And as you can see, we calculate a risk and based on the risk, we recommend what should be the interval and below is a snapshot of the application. With that said, let me get into the application. Now I've logged into APM and I am sitting on a pressure relief device, PSV, and this is an RBI view for that. And this is the component details where you can see the damage mechanism associated with it and all the analysis that is done. But when you select an PRD component, you can also see all the equipments which it is protecting. So at times you can have one pressure relief device between multiple assets. If I get into this analysis, what it tells you from the analysis result is what is your driving probability of failure based on your current interval, which means if you are doing a time-based inspection at an interval of 2.5 years or two years, this is your current risk, right? So the risk category is medium and your current inspection interval is say every 2.5 years or two years. But the RBI module tells you if you extend your interval by five years, your risk category is going to jump by one level, which is medium to medium high. And that would be the recommendation that would be provided by the application. So. It helps you to tell you what is the risk based on your current time-based program, but it also recommends you what should be the best optimized interval. So based on an RBI program, it tells you you can extend your interval to 60 months, and it also gives you a recommended inspection scope of work. So with that said, this is a very quick demo, but it showed how you can have a well-defined industry best practice for doing risk-based inspection on your pressure relief devices. And it also helps you with visualization of the risk based on your current interval and based on an RBI interval and helps you to take better quantified decisions. If you have any questions, please do reach out to me and I'll be more than happy to reply those questions. Thank you. <music>